Miguel Cabrera, Jose Altuve, two of the best in baseball, two of the best from Venezuela. Thank you for coming together. How's the farewell tour going, Mickey? Excellent. <laughs> Are you enjoying it? A uh, little bit. A little bit? A lot yeah. of media comes uh, with it. Yeah, I don't like that kind of stuff, you know. I don't want to be there in the middle, the attention. So much attention. Yeah. Uh, who, do you, who loves interviews more out of the two of you? Jose. No, probably Miggy. No, I don't like interviews. <laughs> I get nervous. Can you believe this is this is kind of the the end for Miggy, and this is the last time you guys will face off in a series? No, it's hard to believe, and I'm starting to get a little bit uh, emotional about it, just to know that today will be my last two games against Miggy. You know, the, a guy that I used to look up to when I was a kid, and one you know every Venezuelan kid wanted to be like him. And now that he's just gonna retire, we're gonna, you know, miss him a lot. It's my my friend. It's my brother. I love him, but on my heart, I always wish the best to him. For you, Jose, you know, all of his accomplishments, the numbers he's reached, uh, you know, they're they're all over the ballpark here at Comerica Park and, and counting. What's most impressive? I think the fact that he got 500 homers and 3,000 hits is. You know, it's incredible. It's amazing. Not a lot of people have been able to do that. And like I said, just to be able to call in my friend when he did all that, it's just insane. And we, as a Venezuelan, the whole country is really proud of him. And like I said many times, we're going to miss him. What, did, what is he capable of? What's his potential? Yes, I think he's going to be a Hall of Fame. What do you think when you hear that? Uh, you know, it means a lot, especially coming from him, but it's a long way to go. For you to be able to lean on Miggy, you've said it, you know, just he's helped you in so many ways, answers the phone. How important is that to any major league player who's playing this, this game that's so hard? No, it means a lot. He was having a triple crown season when I was struggling a little bit, so he should be paying attention to us in his own numbers, in his own stuff, but he's still picked the phone out for me and said, hey, what do you need? Career batting averages for active players. Tuve's hitting 307. You're at 306. When you guys are both done, who's going to end up on top? Two hands. No, probably Maggie. <laughs> Two hands because I have one more one more month left, so yeah, I think I'm going to have a lot of more years. Uh, like I said before, if he's healthy, I think he's able to put good numbers in the field, so we're going to pray for that. Um, hopefully he can finish his career in Houston and finish his career like, in the top, and hopefully he can get a thousand more hits. And you'll have more time to answer his text, maybe watch some videos. Yeah, I got a lot of time. <laughs> <laughs> what will you miss about Miggy, the Major League player? I think he is, you know, his character as a player, he's always enjoying the game. He takes everything serious, but at the same time, he's enjoying what he's doing. He's having a lot of fun, and he's living the dream. So I think that's the way you should be out there, you know, playing hard, but at the same time, enjoying every pitch, every moment, like, like Miggy does. I miss playing the field a lot. Me being first base, joke with the running, trying to throw talking trash to the opponents in the, the dugout. Um, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna miss oh, oh, all the stuff I do in the field. But at the same time, I gotta, I, I'm gonna get a chance. I spend time with my kids. I'm gonna have a chance to see him more play. And I'm gonna enjoy. I'm gonna enjoy my retirement. And I always say thank God for giving me this opportunity to play the sport I love. And I don't take anything for granted in the field. So I'm happy. I'm happy with my career. And I'm happy what he's doing in his career, so he needs to keep going, stay healthy, and we pray for, for a thousand him more. <laughs>